Hi everyone and welcome back to another video and in today's video we're going to talk about time management tips for student athletes. So let's get straight into it. So the first tip is using time blocking for your homework. So basically you would want to map out your homework into your calendar and use that time only for your homework and block out all other activities. So once you have this time block in your calendar, you would be able to say no to all other activities as you've scheduled your homework into your calendar and so you have a designated time to do your homework that will not be interrupted by other activities. So if you have blocked some time in your calendar for your homework but you still have problems with doing your homework at that time as you find yourself procrastinating, tip number two is to find an accountability partner. So basically, you set up a meet with your friend and both of you can study together at the same time. So research has shown that students are more likely to study whenever they have an accountability partner or a study buddy. And the best part about a study buddy is that both of you can help each other and you can discuss topics and get to know your weaknesses and then overcome them together. So tip number three is to finish your assignments in chronological order. Basically, what this means is you do your assignments as you get them, as this will prevent you from piling up your assignments and then causing you to have stress in the end when you have to send in all your assignments at once. So make sure you do them as you get them, as this will reduce your stress and will also allow for more free time for you to do other things. Well, if you're enjoying this video so far, make sure you leave a thumbs up and leave a comment down below on what you're struggling with as a student athlete or as an athlete overall and what kind of video you would want me to make next. So let's get straight into tip number four. So tip number four is to not stretch yourself too thin. Since you're already an athlete and you have academics on your plate, try not to join too many societies or clubs or give yourself too many responsibilities. This would only cause you to go into more stress and you would have more things to do in between classes. So this means that you wouldn't have enough time to catch up with your academics or you would have to sacrifice either your training or your academics, which is something you definitely do not want to do. So tip number five is to get to know your professors. At the beginning of the semester, go introduce yourself to your professors and let them know that you're a student athlete. Tell them your goals and also tell them that you might need extra help from them since you'd be training and you might have to miss some of your classes. This will make it much, much easier for you to go knocking on your door whenever you need your help as you build a good connection with them. So that is all for this video. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. Let me know what you'd want to watch next in the comment section down below. And I'll see you in the next video.